Today's episode on Game Changers in Agriculture is Bio. Bio is a farm co-op looking at how to uh, bull genetics and uh, bull performance uh, went private and has developed management systems for measuring performance of entire herds and entire flocks. So it's now looking at goats, now looking at sheep. And here's the important part. Our knowledge that they have created in a farm co-op is now going to Malaysia, is going to Vietnam, and in fact, they're going to Brazil to sell our knowledge on how do we manage herds and be able to tell what are the best performing animals. Bio is a very unique organization. It started 20 years ago. Uh, it was actually uh, started in 1993 when the Ontario government took the beef record of performance programs and spun them into an or a private organization. So Bio is a producer organization uh, run by a board of directors as a not-for-profit cooperative. Uh, it has changed a great deal in those 20 years, particularly in the last five, as we've moved from just beef genetic improvement into livestock information management. So we're now multi-species, international, still with genetic improvement at our core, uh, but much broader than our origins saw us. Yes, we started out as strictly a beef organization and for about the first 15 years stayed with beef. Really interesting evolution has happened. In uh, about four years ago, Ontario Cattlemen's came to us and said we're having people wanting to set up value chains. They're asking us for some assistance to set up a database. And very astutely, uh, OCA said, but you've already got a database, can you make that work? for value chains and we said well yes we can. So they gave us some seed funding to start Biotrack and that was the beginning of some Biotrack. So over the next year we developed Biotrack to allow producers through a web-based system to capture information easily, store it securely, access it anywhere anytime and get value added from that information. Bio's markets uh, have changed dramatically in the last five years. Our markets started out with our core business, beef genetic improvement, largely based in Ontario, with some growth in Canada and the United States. But about five years ago, as we started to develop Biotrack, being web-based, we're now open for business to the world. Uh, we're seeing a lot of potential internationally on the small ruminant side, so sheep and goats. In fact, we just had our um, first really large international client sign up, and he's in Trinidad and he has 4,000 ewes and 1,000 does split between milking and meat. And a lot of interest in the Caribbean and Southeast Asia. We're working really closely with an organization called Inter-America Institute for Cooperation on Agriculture, or AICA. They're out of Ottawa. Um, they have 34 member nations. And they see a lot of opportunity for people in their member countries to make use of a system like Biotrack. Through our system, uh, producers can input information on their cattle, sheep, or goats. And automatically that information will spin out of our system to a genetic evaluation system. What producers then get back is an evaluation on every single animal on a weekly basis across breeds so they can know which are their better animals genetically. An example of how important that is on the beef side, we've evaluated over 12,000 bulls in the last 10 years, so young males that could be selected to be the next herd sire. And the difference, the one year difference of picking one bull over another is thousands of dollars in your operation. Biotrack itself is software. Um, one of the things that we've really tried to focus on is the fact that some producers have hardware on farm and that could be an electronic scale head, it could be a, a wand reader, it could be a handheld of some sort. We can supply them with a, a piece of hardware but that's not our main interest. Our main interest is making information flow easy. So one of the things we've done is developed a data transfer whereby if somebody has hardware on their farm, as long as it can export a CSV file, then we can do a data mapping, they do it once and then they can and transfer data from Biotrack to the handheld of their choice, take information out to the barn or the field, come back, put it into the secure system. We actually hire Q9 networks in Mississauga to store that data. So all they do is data, data storage and backup. So your data is completely secure uh, through Biotrack. Welcome to Gilbria Farm. Uh, we're kind of a diversified operation in, the, in Erin and, and we're in the business of providing seed stock to commercial producers. Uh, we also export bulls to uh, a, a cattle program in the United States. So uh, at, 
we, we've improved our own herd and, and we can see those results by going back through our historical data with bio uh, and we look forward to improving as, as we move ahead. Uh, every year we, we run a, a heifer development program on the farm uh, in cooperation with bio to, to analyze the data that we collect um, and decide which animals we want to keep as uh, females for the future. So we've been involved with bio recently in a, a genomics project where we've used uh, uh, genomics or genetic information to uh, measure uh, feed efficiency on our animals as well as the tenderness. And that way we can select for animals that meet the uh, ultimate consumer's uh, needs in terms of providing tender animals for the plate. So, so in terms of data recording, we use uh, bio's uh, software called BioTrack. Um, and we're able to enter calves uh, in the field as they're born, frankly. That's a new addition, so we can use the mobile app in our cell phones to enter the calving data right in the field, which is tremendous. That way the scraps of paper that we used to try and transport from here to the office don't get lost. The information's right in there. Um, it allows us to record herd health events um, and weighing and, uh, frankly, all the data that we want to collect. Uh, gets recorded in BioTrack and, and because it's, it's a web server somewhere else, I can access it from uh, any, any computer or cell phone anywhere. So if I'm standing here and someone has a question about one of these animals, I can pull that data up and we can have a full history on the animal, its birth weight, its birth date, sire, dam, uh, any health events that have occurred as well as all the performance data once we have some of the records entered. We will have more requirements around traceability recording and the, the approach we've taken is rather than taking the cost of identifying your animals and the your cost of your time keeping track of information and sending it wherever it needs to go we've embedded that within BioTrack so that you can meet your traceability requirements but do it in a system that lets you use what you want whether it's genetics or health protocols or those sorts of things so it's again trying to make things easy most people don't like record keeping Farmers in particular don't like record keeping. We know that. Uh, we're really trying to make it as easy as possible to meet requirements and meet your, their needs as a business.